like it could go either way, but that's just a matter because Link, he doesn't have the greatest uh, uh, speed in his boxing scenarios either. He's going to be a button check, looks like. Because his fastest ground move is uh, frame 7 with that spin attack. And I believe Jab is frame 7 or frame 6 as well. Not the fastest moves considering other characters and what they can do in close range combat. But the other thing is DK doesn't really have that either. So it's going to be a matter of who spaces better, who gets the setups that they need, who gets that you know down tilt into like grab or whatever DK yeah. is looking for, stuff like that. And at the end of the day, if the uh, link player, if Rex, if he really wanted to, he could just commit to the lame play and just sit back with his plethora of projectiles. He has the bomb, he has the boomerang, and the arrows to work with. So he can definitely layer those together and create some sort of wall that's going to be really tough for that one guy to get over. Yeah. I, I mean, I always say that like, in the Zelda games, Link in general is just kind of like a goofball. Yeah. Like, you can see it in his like, facial expressions yep. and stuff. But in this game, he's kind of like 200 IQ character. So oh. <laughs> you got you to gotta have like a 200 IQ to play this character. For because you, you can do so much off of just bomb alone. Yeah. And then you add two more projectiles and his pressure you can do with his uh, sword attacks. Makes it very difficult. Your but brain needs start. to be the size of the universe for sure. Yeah. Um, we're going to see a high percentage ratio of matches starting off on Pokemon Stadium 2. Yeah, for the most part, like everything is going to be on. And then, and then we get later on in the bracket, and it's just like, yeah, you want to play just PS2 every game? Yeah, best of five? Sure, yeah. why not? But already, 82% practically unanswered from the one guy. We can see the projectiles are coming out, as we mentioned before. Uh -oh. yeah, until Trip confirm it's a grab, I like it. Getting that percentage back that he lost. Sent him the wrong way, that was unfortunate. But yeah, using that bomb tech, when you use it as Link, you want to make sure when you pull up the bomb, you wait for the animation to put him back onto his shoulders. Then you can Z drop and then uh, and then go ahead and get the explosion put you back onto the stage. Okay, dash attack, no jump here. He's going to pull the bomb, but it's going to be too late. Rex falling to his doom. That one guy with the great edge guard there. I feel like he kind of forgot that his bomb was already on stage. He detonated yeah. and then realized he had to mash for another one, yeah. and he didn't have enough time to get back down. All right, pulls out another bomb. What's going to be the edge guard? He tries to catch him with the up tilt, but he does manage to find the uh, frame trap and then get the grab to throw him back off stage. Another bomb will get that stock. I, I don't know if he Z dropped it or what. It looked like he caught it with his back air because you can't detonate the bomb if your opponent is holding it. Right. So that might have been he accidentally Z dropped it afterwards and then that, that led to his death. Ooh, boomerang the fair. That's a thing. Yep. Oh, boomerang the fair. Snap. Down to the fair. He's got a lot of setups into his big hitting moves. And you just got to be in close enough range to be able to get it. Oh, bro. All right, Rex starting to run away with it on this second stock. He wasn't going to let that first stock uh, get to his mentality. Definitely holding it down right now. Yep, and sometimes it's just difficult for DK to come back if he doesn't My have God. options. No <laughs> jump, no air dodge. He's just kind of stuck off there, right. and he's going to have to take those bombs. Yeah, that bomb alone seems like it's going to be a really tough uh, tool to deal with in the offstage phase versus Link. Yeah. Oh. I think he's going to make it back in high recovery, recognizing that super, or that one guy was trying to get something off stage. All right, he sets the bomb up, actually putting some, the fear in that one guy's heart, able to get the grab. Forward air, not enough to do the trick. Ooh, the pivot forward tilt. This is just enough. Run off stage. Yeah, down throw. Try to find the mix-up afterwards. Not going to get it, though. All right. Stuck off stage, but he's going to make it back with those pairs and puts them on bad position. There's the bomb again, dude. You just toss it at, in, in the vicinity of DK's area, and you just it detonate it before he can grab it or anything, and it's just like, boom, you're dead, dog. Yeah, don't, you don't get to make it back. Mm -hmm. And the big thing that happened there was that wow. Rex used that Z-drop aerial while holding the bomb. Yeah. Just used that Nair, put him off stage, catch it again. Didn't need the time to pull out the bomb, so he's able to quickly combo into another explosion, and that's going to be the first game going to Rex. And game number two between Rex and that one guy going to Town and City. So Town and City is going to have a bigger uh, top blast zone, which I can't imagine. Um, I don't know. I don't know why why you would pick this stage versus... Uh, well, I, mean, I, I would say Battlefield's probably banned, right? Yeah. I, I don't know. We'll, we'll have to see. But we got the up air juggles three in a row. Ooh. He's trying to finish it off with some bears. Not quite going to be able to find it, though. Yeah. Link's uh, bear out of shield, sometimes not the greatest, same deal that DK's bear out of shield has is it doesn't quite hit the area that you want them to when you're landing with aerials. It just doesn't quite connect the hurtboxes correctly. Oh my god, dude. 
Alright, neutral air punishing to get up attack from that one guy. He falls off with another neutral air and the high recovery is going to get caught by the up B. Rex pulling ahead on this game number two with an extremely dominant first stock. Yeah, with that increased vertical height on the hero spin, it's such a good edge guard tool. It's like, you're going low, I'll use the bomb to cover it, and then I'll go high with the hero spin. Oh my god, a crucial directional air dodge from Rex right there to make it back to the ledge, avoiding that forward air altogether. Still working on extending this lead right now. Oh, most of their up tilts clank. Unfortunate, but yeah, using the pressure from the boomerangs on those aerials, forcing them to either shield or spot dodge, and he's able to get those punishes correctly. Oh, just catching a landing with a quick forward smash, and that second hit is going to be so strong. We're starting to see some item combos coming out from Rex as well. He's definitely feeling it. Yeah. I feel like Rex wanted to get the back hit of the Nair to bounce into the other direction and potentially combo after that, but he's still getting a decent-sized combo. The platform's actually saving that one guy from getting completely obliterated, and he's a little bit too low, so he's going to lose that next stock. All right, but he's still got two more to work with, and... Uh, that one guy halfway to kill percent, practically. 68% hero spin out of shield. He's been using that to punish the uh, forward tilt at max distance pretty consistently, actually. So he knows the range on that very well. Oh, I don't think he has a jump oh, anymore. Oh, he's gone. Yep, run off there. Oh, he makes it back. Yeah, if Rex was being an adventurer, he could have just done the hero spin off stage. I don't think he was quite looking for that. Here comes a bomb. He's going to air dodge through it, and he's going to get grabbed for it. Oh. Oh. Yeah, that's unfortunate. Um, that's another reason why the bomb is such a great pressure tool. It has a constant hitbox as it's bouncing, and it bounces five times. Or oh, four, four, one or four times. And that's going to pull you in yep. to the direction of the blast zone. And Rex with the two stock and only 30%, man.